And so as we now join the tandem championship, we're at the repercharge stage. The winner of this group between Greece, Slovakia and the Czech Republic will find a place in the semi-finals where Italy, Australia and Germany have already qualified. And the riders on the front now are from Slovakia, Berchik and Bacilic. And they're being chased by the Czech riders, Dracmanek and Hargos. And it's going to be a battle between the old country and the new one as they come off the banking neck and neck here. And in fact, there was a trouble on the banking there because the riders who went down with the Slovaki and now the Czech Republic have crashed as well. The Greece went over the line in the end in third place, but there will be a rerun of this race. And we'll have a look now exactly what has happened in the slow motion. Now you can see here on the inside, it is the Slovak riders who fall. And it is the Czech riders who have leaned on them very, very hard indeed. And the Czech riders come over the line and they fall as well. And as a result of that, the Slovak team was disqualified. And in the rerun, the Czech Republic were triumphant over Greece. And so they went on to meet Italy in the semi-finals. And it was in those semi-finals where the Italian pair of Federico Paris and Roberto Chiappa had little trouble in knocking the Czech Republic out of the competition to qualify for the final. In the other semi-final there was also sensation when the German pair here up against the Australian tandem were also involved in a battle around the final corner into the home straight. The Australian team had the inside of Danny Day and Steve Pate and then the elbows started clashing and then the Australian team fell and the referee said they were deliberately caused to crash by Emmanuel Rash and Marcus Nagel of the German team. They were disqualified out of the competition which put Australia into the final against the Italian tandem. And in fact in the crash both Stephen Pate and Danny Day were extremely concussed and we can have a look at that again now. It takes a very brave man to go through on the inside but they had the right of way and the Germans in fact closed the door just a little bit too hard. Steve Pate suffered a little bit of a head injury but there's no doubt the Germans disqualified out of the competition Australia now into the final against Italy and into the second match now with the Australians one down in this best of three final in the tandems the comparatively inexperienced tandem of the Australians has the lead Danny Day is the man they call the stoker at the back and in the front is Steve Pate against Federico Paris and Roberto Chiappa and the Italians throughout this championship have shown great speed. Now it's going to be up to the Australians to hold the tandem high from the boys in blue. But they're too fast. They're too fast as it happened in the first run in this final contest as well. The Italians rode away from the Australians. Maybe there's the effect of the crash as well. But the Australians have lost the medal. They've got the silver. And the championship won by, for my money, the best tandem in this championship. The riders from Italy. And so the Italians at last get a gold medal out of these championships, the second Australia and third the Czech Republic.